which of the following is the largest blood vessel in the body your options are vein artery capillary or aorta the correct answer is d that is aorta the aorta is the largest artery in the body carrying oxygenated blood from the heart to the rest of the body let's move on to the question number 2 what is the primary function of veins your options are transport oxygen rich blood carry blood away from the heart return the oxygenated blood to the heart or to exchange nutrients and waste the correct answer is c that is to return the oxygenated blood to the heart veins carry the oxygenated blood back to the heart except for the pulmonary veins which carry oxygenated blood let's move on to the question number 3 which blood vessel has the thickest walls your options are capillary vein artery or venule the correct answer is c that is artery arteries have thick elastic walls to withstand the high pressure of blood being pumped from the heart question number 4 which type of blood vessel is responsible for the exchange of gases and nutrients your options are artery vein capillary or aorta the correct answer is c that is capillary capillaries have thin walls that allow the exchange of oxygen carbon dioxide and other nutrients between blood and tissues question number 5 what is the function of arterioles your options are transport blood to capillaries return blood to the heart supply blood to the lungs or exchange nutrients the correct answer is a that is to transport blood to the capillaries arterioles are small branches of arteries that lead into capillaries and regulate blood flow by constricting or dilating question number 6 hello friends welcome back to dear competitive exam youtube channel today you are attending 100 most repeated and most important question answer session based on types of blood vessels and this is the part 1 of this series so let's challenge your quality of learning let's see what will be your score out of 50 from this part 1 so do watch this video completely to make yourself more fit to answer any kind of question and at the end if you find this video helpful then please do like subscribe and share this video to all your friends who are preparing for upcoming any kinds of medical exams let's continue question number 6 which blood vessels have walls to prevent back flow your options are arteries veins capillaries or arterioles the correct answer is d that is veins veins have walls that prevent the back flow of blood especially in the limbs where blood is returned to the heart against gravity question number 7 where are capillaries most numerous Your options are skin, heart, brain, or all of the above. The correct answer is D. That is all of the above. 
Capillaries are distributed throughout the body, especially in tissues that require a high exchange of nutrients such as skin, heart and brain. Question number 8. Which blood vessels carry oxygenated blood? Your options are veins, pulmonary veins, pulmonary arteries or none of the above. The correct answer is B that is pulmonary veins. Pulmonary veins carry oxygenated blood from the lungs to the heart unlike other veins which carry deoxygenated blood. Question number 9. What is the main characteristic of arteries? Your options are They have thin walls They carry blood away from the heart They carry deoxygenated blood Or They contain walls The correct answer is B that is they carry blood away from the heart the arteries transport oxygen-rich blood from the heart to the rest of the body with exception of pulmonary artery. Question number 10. Which blood vessel connects arteries to veins? Two options are capillary, arteriole, venule or aorta. The correct answer is A that is capillary. Capillaries connect the arterial and venous system, allowing nutrient and gas exchange between blood and tissues. Question number 11. Which layer is found in all blood vessels? Your options are Tunica adventitia, Tunica entima, Tunica media or Tunica externa? The correct answer is B that is Tunica intima. The Tunica intima is the innermost layer of all blood vessels and it is made up of a single layer of endothelial cells. Question number 12. In which vessel does the blood pressure fluctuate the most? Your options are veins, arteries, capillaries or arterioles. The correct answer is B that is arteries. Arteries experience the highest fluctuation in blood pressure because they directly receive blood from the heart's contractions. Question number 13. Which vessels are known as resistance vessels? Your options are arteries, arterioles, capillaries or veins. The correct answer is B that is arterioles. Arterioles control blood flow and pressure through vasoconstriction and vasodilation, earning them the name called resistance vessels. Question number 14. What type of blood do pulmonary arteries carry? Two options are oxygenated, deoxygenated, both oxygenated and deoxygenated, or none. The correct answer is B that is deoxygenated. Pulmonary arteries carry deoxygenated blood from the right ventricle of the heart to the lungs for oxygenation. Question number 15. What is the role of venules? Two options are return blood to the arteries, carry blood from capillaries to veins, oxygenate the blood or regulate blood pressure. The correct answer is B that is to carry blood from capillaries to vein. Venules 
are small vessels that collect deoxygenated blood from capillaries and transport it to veins. Question number 16. Which vessel supplies the heart with oxygenated blood? Your options are Aorta Coronary Artery Pulmonary Artery or Inferior Vena Cava The correct answer is B that is Coronary Artery. The Coronary Artery supplies the heart muscle with oxygen rich blood ensuring it functions properly. Question number 17. Which blood vessels have the slowest blood flow? The options are arteries, capillaries, veins or venules. The correct answer is B that is capillaries. Blood flow is slowest in capillaries to allow sufficient time for the exchange of gases, nutrients and waste. Question number 18. Which layer in arteries is responsible for vasoconstriction? Your options are Tunica intima, Tunica media, Tunica externa or endothelium. The correct answer is B that is tunica media. The tunica media made up of smooth muscle controls the constriction and dilation of blood vessels regulating blood flow. Question number 19. Which of the following is a characteristic of veins? The options are thick walls carry blood at high pressure have walls or carry blood away from the heart? The correct answer is C that is have walls. Veins contain walls to prevent the backflow of blood as they carry blood at low pressure toward the heart. Question number 20. Which vessel carries blood from the digestive organs to the liver? Your options are Hepatic vein Hepatic portal vein Inferior vena cava or Renal vein The correct answer is B that is Hepatic portal vein. The hepatic portal vein carries nutrient-rich blood from the digestive organs to the liver for processing. Question number 21. Which type of blood vessel primarily transports blood under high pressure? Two options are veins, capillaries, arteries or venules. The correct answer is C that is arteries. Arteries carry blood from the heart under high pressure which is why their walls are thick and elastic to accommodate the pressure changes. Question number 22. Which blood vessels play a key role in regulating blood flow and pressure through vasoconstriction and vasodilation? Two options are Arteries, arterioles, capillaries or veins? The correct answer is B that is arterioles. Arterioles by constricting or dilating regulate the amount of blood that enters capillary beds, affecting overall blood pressure. Question number 23. Which of the following best describes the structure of capillaries? The options are Thick walls with smooth muscle Single layer of endothelial cells Walls containing walls Or 
elastic fibers for stretching? The correct answer is B. That is single layer for endothelial cells. Capillaries have very thin walls, just one cell thick, to facilitate the exchange of gases, nutrients, and waste products. Question number 24. What is the function of the tunica externa in blood vessels? Two options are facilitate gas exchange, provide structural support, regulate blood pressure, or prevent backflow of blood. The correct answer is B that is provide structural support. The tunica externa, also known as the tunica adventitia, is the outer layer of blood vessels that provides structural integrity and protection. Question number 25. Which blood vessels return oxygen poor blood to the heart? The options are capillaries, arteries, veins or arterioles. The correct answer is C, that is veins. The veins return deoxygenated blood to the heart, except for pulmonary veins, which return oxygen-rich blood from the lungs. Friends, it is a time to comment your score out of 25 questions. And friends, thanks for joining us on this exciting journey. If you enjoyed the quiz and learned something new, then give us a thumbs up and let us know in the comment section. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on our upcoming exploration of fascinating topics in the medical field. Until the next time, stay curious, stay healthy. See you. Take care.